Marty. That's because I haven't showered in five years. There's more. Just don't, just don't yeah. press shift while you're in it. You're gonna, you're gonna destroy it. And if you're using controller, don't press it. Yes, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we got the killer here with us too. Oh, oh my god, this is too funny. There's the killer, the other green one. Follow the leader. Follow oh, he's happy. He's definitely happy. It's good. It's good. <laughs> What the fuck are we doing in our goddamn lives? Is this the true Jeff definition of jacking off? Give me some of that white stuff, brother. Give me some of that white stuff here. Here, fuck it. Yeah, yeah, fucking training five. Fucking training a high five. God damn, bro. This looks so fucking hilarious. How the fuck are we getting so lucky with the killers? You know what? They were like, fuck it. Oh, I missed. Oh, we have <laughs> So happy! What the fuck? We go to random lobbies and we can convert the killer into a lovely human being. Oh my god, I love uh... this. This is too fucking good. <laughs> Is wrong. <laughs> oh my god, dude. We're just laughing. This has definitely made my nay. Holy fuck. Oh. You? <gasps> we missed those high fives. Oh shit, we should move out of his way. <laughs> <laughs> Get an outfit. How is this happening? All the other times have I tried to do this, I just get fucking slaughtered. Ah. Easy. <laughs> you get extra points when you leave with. <clears throat> Are you my papa? Are you my dada? Are you my dada? Are you dad? Oh yeah. Daddy. Oh. I can. Ooh. Made it. Yo. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, the heads? But I know I'm sexy, my guy. Oh, yeah. 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 But... Yeah. I just saw that motherfucker run all the way over here. <laughs> Oh, is that you? Sometimes, isn't it? No, nah, it's not me. You can't see me in the dots. Look at the dots. Yo, oh, dude, I dots. see you. I see you. you... <laughs> no, I'm just joking. I... <laughs> How do you see me? You can see me in the dots? No. That would be sweet, though. To stand... Yeah. You standing there. Yeah. Teddy bear. See that my collection. Yes. <laughs> my favorite. Yeah. <laughs> beer. There's still more beer on this map. Where's your body? Oh man, I can only like carry it one at a time. You've been busy then. Place this fucking cookie. <gasps> Holy shit! Place this fucking cookie. <gasps> Holy shit! Oh, we vented <laughs> on ya. <laughs> oh fuck, dude. Oh, that scared the shit out of me. That's how you piss yourself right there. Oh, oh damn. <laughs> oh, damn. <laughs> oh. 
cruel and unusual. <laughs> Holy fuck. I'm still bringing beer. I'm still buying more. <laughs> <laughs> We just have this massive collection is... going in there by that computer. <laughs> Should I just walk around with this cookie? Where am I? <gasps> Fuck you, Smiley. Where? <gasps> nope. 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 Oh, he fucking got me. <laughs> 940 for the radio. Oh, shit. I was just letting the other guy know. Oh my fucking god. Thank you, Daniel. Hello, Jack. It's safe. Oh, no. Hey, what is going on? How's everyone doing? Hey Toxic, how are you? I'm good, I'm good. I seriously need an IT tech for my computer. Drinks put down for ten seconds. It's free game, bud. All right, guys, a few more details. That's good. We'll need boiler suits I'm and masks for this job. Good. The garbage truck. Let's get one from your park. Bring it back to the lot. And there's an auto repair place by the airport where we can get a tow truck. What else? Uh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Get away. That would be nice. Get something fast and discreet. We park it off the road, a good distance from the lot. And make sure it ain't near something we'll crash into driving off. That's it. All right, man, I got you, dawg. What? Huh? I missed that. Maybe shout a little louder? Bite me. Are you talking about online? Oh, yeah, yeah, so. Hey, I haven't seen you at the Epsilon training. You okay? Hey, yeah, yeah. Sweet. Sure. What is he doing? Hey. Where was that at? So, we're starting. Heists or when it comes to imaginary friends, I'm strictly old fashioned. For the last time, child, we don't believe in anything. There are no secrets. Children of the Mountain is an accredited study program. Follow us and you'll be free from all belief. You'll be free from knowledge. You'll be free to share that with others. Uh, what? This is lunacy. <clears throat> Your hostility is really depressing, Laszlo. You see clearly, Michelle. Laszlo, there's a mountain up there. Let me show you. Oh, get out of the way. Listen, dude, I've been to the mountaintop, okay? I've been to a lot of concerts and done a lot of drugs. I've been up there, okay? I got a top-rated talent show on TV. Who used that as a getaway vehicle? Talk show. Oh, damn. I thought it was going to stop. I believe in one thing only. Excuse me. To screw up. One stupid word. One inappropriate comment. Oh, my God. An, an innocent caress between colleagues. You know? And it begins again. The slow descent down. Your ratings come down a bit. The groupies, they start to get older and chunkier and... Have that weird fat girl smell. 
You appear in commercials Back for worse and worse and worse cars, and suddenly you're not the spokesperson for an expensive Swiss watch, but for some swingers resort in Guatemala or a war zone. Uh, you're on the way down, so you get desperate. You do, you do more and more insane things for ratings. You don't care, but it's no good. The public doesn't love you anymore. Nobody loves you. There's a, a great hole of lovelessness inside you. You're just a shell. Nobody cares. How are you going to say you're that we need war the wars? They won't call you if I remember they correctly. Bleach you anymore. Your, your life invader friends start to go down. The, the private members' clubs tell you that you're no longer welcome because you tried to speak to a movie star there. Well, I was a star once, okay? I was, but it's no good. It, it just, it just, it keeps going down. It's okay. It just keeps My going. Child. It's not okay. Your producer calls you up. Someone made up some pictures that they seem to show you, you know, being spanked in a brothel. That's not true. Anyhow. I can put my head on any dude's body. I'm much bigger than that. It's compute. Do some heist missions. First, there weren't any cameras in there, you know. It, and then they start calling you a misogynist in the press and a bleeder. You know, it's not true. You hate me. I love, women. Right. I love women. They call me gay, and that's not true. Laszlo's a man. He's a man. I mean, my grandpa thought of PC. Still keeps coming. The, the great wall of shame. The sound of loneliness just flows on and on like you're For, on the ground. And there's just a group of men. Five of them. I have yet to do it. One day your producer comes in and says, Laszlo. Once I beat, or well, finish the story mode, I don't know if it would be today, but then I was going to work on five characters. Space monkeys. Yeah, we're gonna do the space monkeys. I am highly trained. Keep your distance. For that one, 5M is online. I know it's online, but you can still create it. It's my idea. I'm not looking at you. <clears throat> Which one are you talking you about then? I'm gonna destroy you. You got that? Oh, yeah, I'm so scared. Sure, I'm trembling. Listen, I just walked by this dude. He was a total freak. See you in court, more. Wow! Don't you Just to say, I got me, us some jerk. headgear for this masquerade balls up. All right, I'm gonna fuck you up. Fucking asshole! Oh, ah, fuck oh. you. Just oh, yeah. We're going to hell. What? He was asking for it. Don't judge. I wonder if that looks like doing it. it looks like Mike's. Oh no, it's not a four door. American with bloodlust, failure, and swinging. It's not story mode, but for online. Yeah. And only the strong survive. You not only improve yourself, but feel doubly better because someone else is. Isn't you didn't connect the one from your Xbox to your PC, Basic your account? Darwinian yoga revealed hey, the inner truth. WCTR. <laughs> this 
is Chakra Attack. We attack you. I should do the rest of these heists heists first. And we are ready to attack all the negative things in your life. I do and not know baby, if you baby, have to make a different one for five so yeah. fully charged and ready to drive. Yeah, you have to make a different one. Of life. Ba, 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 I'm coming through. Mm. I can know the black moon. I have some spiritual ass jumper cables. And you are about to get some mind boggling current through your body. Man, I just love that metaphor. We are here to deal with your Los Santos County integrated health needs. And I'm your host, Dr. Ray D'Angelo Health. Here are my producer, the game is but the challenge of both different. From your Xbox to your PC. <laughs> like I heard that you can uh, take your account from your, P not your PC, but PlayStation to your Xbox or vice versa from your Xbox to your PlayStation, but you have to let uh, Rockstar know. Something like that. that us, Sounds like a headache. Yeah. That's a cleanse! It cleans your bowels and your soul! Your bowels! Turn, come out to answer! Oh, stop making things up! I'm not barren! Who even uses the term barren? What are you. What are we doing? Five, three. Boiler suits? I am highly trained. Keep your distance. Jeez, you look like you've been in the wars. Fuck off. Uh, three boiler suits. Well, right here. I just want all my babies to go to a good home. Come off the shopping list. It's the smoothie you made me. I'm kind of bugging out. That's because it's the Ray D'Angelo Harris bug out smoothie with spirulina, which is nature's PCP. This I'm sweet, sorry, Cheryl. You know, you know I love you, area. but sometimes you need to be yelled at. I want the mm -hmm. X series game mm -hmm. Cheryl, right with now. my right now. real character mm -hmm. and it's stuck there. Right now, get that I get play it. as get it. I play it. Mm -hmm. I'm a cat. <laughs> don't, 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 don't do it on the air. Don't do it. Now look, I'm a hum. I'm a what do you mean? In my hand, okay. And I'll throw this um in your mouth. Open your mouth. Okay. Open your mouth now. And it's about to both the same distance. Hey! Yes, oh! Oh, no, 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 um. You open your mouth. I'm going to throw you my um. And my um going to go in your mouth. Okay. Open your mouth. Boy. My um is going to go in your mouth. Okay. Guys, remember, you still need to set I know, dude. Hey, man, what's up? You caught it. That's what I want you to do. I still love you. That one. Let it go. That one right there. This is gonna be our getaway vehicle. with caffeine and sugar to power your workout or important meeting thanks to TCS Energy Pro. Yes, it has an acronym because it's a fully They say it could be used as a
Yeah. We all say the B is just good. Select the mark. Select the mark. Get away location option. Keep remembering that. Okay. Don't be thinking about what you don't got. Just get some of this soul, baby. We have a getaway vehicle ready and waiting. Good work, T. Where'd you put it? Pillbox Hill. Oh, wait, this is Pillbox? Oh, wait, right there is Pillbox. Okay. Where the fuck did this truck go? What? Am I delusional? Didn't I just leave it right there? Oh, you stupid. Still no bank tonight. He didn't message me at all today, so I don't know if he's gaming or not. That's not actually doing anything, is it? I hope he's doing well and not like got himself into trouble or something. Raising awareness. Bumper stickers create change. People see that shit and think while they drive it. To be a content writer. At a red light. Right now, I'm gonna visualize world peace. Like you're training right now, and you decide to stop and say hi. They're not sure if I will accept the job, just trying to see what the job is. That's right. I'm tired of all the so called Ben told that it's uh. Depending on what you're writing about, it's kind of difficult. I cut you open, I gut you open, I eat your thigh, I eat your calf, I eat your stomach muscles, don't baby back ribs, I eat your neck bones, to different game raw. Games. Do you hear me? Do you hear me? You're going down. I can't concentrate with them screaming my ear. Different Xbox series. I mean, was transferred to the X series. It is stuck there, but it's okay because I'm still gaming with Taylor on it. Oh, gotcha. Oh, I see what you mean. Like when you. Yeah, I got it. I'm actually waiting for the right time to check on Bank. I don't want to see him overbearing. Oh. Oh, well. Yeah. I feel the same way. Besides, he usually messages me back, it seems when he's about to go online. I don't know if his Discord is connected to his phone like mine is, so every time he messages me, no matter what I'm doing, I get it.
or if it's just on his computer because that's what it seems like at this point it's just on his computer so when he gets on his computer he replies back to me What do you mean? What do you mean I don't see you? I don't reply back to you? <laughs> Run! You don't want to end up in the back of this! He's offline on Discord. But like I said, I just hope he's doing well and not like in trouble with the law or something. Cause that's not a good way to start off your new year. I have changed my schedule to every day from around 11, 12 to still about 4 o'clock. I get off at 4 o'clock. Unless I don't work the next day, then I'll game until like 6 a.m. Yeah, I changed my schedule from just Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday to I don't think he'll do anything illegal, but still, it's still boring. Yeah. Well, it was just like the way he last talked to me was just weird. Not like, not like he told me anything, it was just weird. I mean, it's too much to be not okay physically and mentally, yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, 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 go, 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 fuck. Ha ha ha. 
There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. So yeah, my next thing I got Nightbot. And my next thing I'm gonna do for my chat is get alerts. So people can annoy me. I just haven't figured out how to set them up. Send him a message on this, just asking him if he got checked for his tongue. Oh, you didn't mention anything else? That's a good message, then. He's usually open with you, so... If anything was wrong, he'd, he'd tell you. Oh, that could be, I never thought about that. His stomach, he found all his results or something. Well, it got worse. I mean, hopefully it didn't get worse, but... God damn it. <clears throat> I, I put... My thinking was that either it has to do with his ex... Or something else. That's the thing. I'm gonna wait for him to say something first. Yeah. Well, I mean, I don't feel like if we brought it up, he would talk about it. Sanitation truck's there now, so don't you bother. So there's no other... <clears throat> Let's talk. You stay away from them dolphins, girl. I want you for They have some very sophisticated zen shit going on. Swimming in the ocean, performing tricks with red nets, ah, jumping through Jesus. hoops. Fall in love with lonely zookeepers? We can learn a lot from fish. I think they're mammals. Same thing! Don't you correct me on the air in front of my people. Next call, hurry you on the line? I am calling from the San Andreas State Penitentiary. Dead? Oh, this one Did again. Dead? Daddy! Oh my Daddy! god. Oh my god. Every single time a guy calls an integrated health. 
call show from a correctional facility, you think it's your dad. He's not your long-lost father. Actually, I am. Hello, son. Oh, my God. <laughs> I knew this day would come. See, Cheryl? With your hairy nipples and bad energy and undernourished chakra, I've been telling you for years one day How I would be know? reunited with my father. <laughs> Put on some hard woman music right now. Put some hard woman on that a father and a son can spiritually connect them. Daddy, I've been crocheting you an Afghan quilt and scrapbooking and keeping a photo album for us to share together of all our future memories. Oh my God, Dad, <laughs> you don't understand. I am so happy right now. How'd you find me? Well, I was walking by another inmate cell and he was listening to this fruity idiot on the radio. And I went in and said, turn that tofu nonsense off now or I'm gonna shake you. And then you said your name was Dr. Ray D'Angelo Harris. And I said, it can't be. My name is Terrence D'Angelo Harris. And I left you and your mother many years ago. I couldn't believe it was my son on the radio. This is so touching. We should send him all of your books and one of those stand-up cardboard cutouts of you oming. Dad, we gotta do some touching shit together. Heartfelt spiritual moments like on a greeting card commercial. <laughs> Are you gonna take me fishing? <laughs> I love fishing. Ha! I just called to say you're an embarrassment, boy. What? As soon as everyone here in prison found out that I was your father, now the whole place makes fun of me. There's a reason I left you all these years ago. <laughs> On the radio, oh, too. Man. The smoke. <laughs> and I took ten dollars from them. I don't know if any amount of meditating and flowing robe by a koi pond is gonna save me now. Falling apart, Cheryl, over here. I'm falling apart. That man took my heart, Cheryl. He took my heart, made it into a heart snowball, and threw it in my face. This this has been chakra attack with Dr. Ray D'Angelo Harris. Cheryl, hold me. That was funny. Tow truck is at the lot. All right, that's everything. I'll call Steve, tell him we're ready to move on this. He's not a fan. <laughs> We didn't think so. You're just like... You belong. 
shop with people just like you. People that drive hybrids and listen to public radio and argue about recycling. It's unscalable elitism for the sustainable crowd. Open up your mouth and look down at people. It's delicious. It's the grain of truth food stores, naturally exclusive. The issues you care about with commercials you don't. WCTR. I am Fernando Martinez. Thank you. Thank you so much. It's great to be back. Joe, you make the clapping sound effects a little bit too loud. That's my producer, Joe, everybody. She is a woman, not a lady, not a fox, not a chick, not a piece of ass, but a woman. Now listen, for those of you who say Fernando, he's like a dinosaur. He does not understand the modern no, world. Therefore, Fernando, he has gone multicultural. He is very much of this century. I am famous for many things. I have been in this life. Entrepreneur, singer, therapist, artist, disc jockey, philosopher, lover, corporate spokesman, martyr for justice and truth that lives in every man and woman's heart when I was unfairly imprisoned for entirely unproven allegations. In short, I understand life and life she understands me. I have been chosen to help guide you down these crazy rabbits. After my show was taking off the air, now I am making money by talking about money and making love by talking about politics <coughs> and also because I am the new man. No longer do I talk about grabbing the girl by the haunches, riding her like a pampas bull and sating your every manly desire. No, no, no. Those days, they are gone. The medallion, she is off. The children, they have a mommy and daddy to look up to. And I am not making inappropriate remarks by letting my passionate gaze linger on Joe's remarkable form. Not for a second. Oh, shut up. You see, I take the classes, the awareness classes, the 21st century classes. Now I know I live a long time in ignorance. I feel so sorry for treating the women like pieces of meat. Now I treat the women like they are equal to me. Goddesses, it is not appropriate to die. I'm like, uh, I'll listen a bit. Okay. Yeah, it's fine. One of you shits must be here. Hello, Trevor. I missed you. Hello, Wade. I missed you, too. Uh, hello, Trevor. Oh, there. Hey, Hot Lips, where you been hiding? No, no, no nowhere. I got a, a knot lips. the size of a baseball in here, all right? Needs a little, uh, loosening up, all right? Oh. <laughs> Massage me, motherfucker! Good, good. Ah. Ah. Trevor's hard at work, huh? Uh, where's the surrogate child? Who? Uh, the boy! With the stars in his eyes. Not like that. What's not like that? Oh, hey! Hey there, uh, You and him, the old father-son issues? Gives me the fucking creeps. How's the leg rub? Oh, it's excellent! Fuck. You wanna go? No, I'm good, though. Hey, I, I called you boys here to discuss this job that I've been planning. The fuck are you talking about? Shut the fuck up, Michael, all right? You owe me. Hey, did you talk to Lester? I called him. He's in the hospital or something, all right? We keep him out and we get 20%. Well, unless, of course, you go states again and uh, have me arrested. Hey, wasn't like that. You better not have been. I mean, like, you give a fuck. Oh, see, I give a fuck, Michael. It's a position, a fucking viewpoint, all right? Like God, like evolution, like anything else. Sunshine, boredom, lies. That's what we got. Other people, they have other worlds. But for me, I'm like a vulture just circling the desert looking for fucking corpses. You know, a carrion eating motherfucker. Do you understand that? Wow. Woo! Bravo, you fucking idiot. Man, I still don't get the score. What's the fucking plan? We got Floyd, all right? Now, Floyd's got... Not the... Fuck, get out of here, all right? Now, Floyd here works at the port. He puts me onto Meriwether Security, who were running some tests out at sea for Uncle Sam. We're gonna take whatever it is they're testing. Now, 
Got a couple buyers lined up, I guarantee. No problems, no major heat. Mm, let's get going, all right? Let's take our slightly past it vibe to an airfield where I got a sub, got a chopper, I got everything we need. All right, let's do this, you fucks. Sandy Shores Airfield, if you please. Why is Trevor not driving the door to trap? Sandy. Shores. That's quite a distance. What's with this guy? Man, I didn't realize we was going all the way out there either. I've been told your generation are work shy, repeatedly, but this is the first time I've seen it for myself. You won't leave the city for the biggest take of your life? Man, it's not like that. Well, what is it like, huh? You think the world owes you a living? You want money and respect, but you won't cross the street to get it. That useless millennial shit is more of a middle class thing. Where I'm from, hustling is still hustling. And going halfway across the state is still, uh, going halfway across the state. Yeah, well, Sandy Shores is the global headquarters for TP Inc., okay? So we gotta make the trip. TP Inc.? Trevor Phillips Industries. My company. Industries or Incorporated? If it's TP Inc., it'd be Trevor Phillips Incorporated. Just saying. You're mocking me. Nice. Is it so strange that I've made a success of my life? I know that wasn't what you wanted for me when you ran off, but still. Trevor. It's a business, Michael. An honest American business, and there aren't many of them left. Hey, you know this airstrip we're going to, we're managing it. Yeah. I hate to think what you did to the last managers. The lost MC LLP experienced an unexpected downturn. We had to step in. The Lost Motorcycle Club. <laughs> yeah, you're a serious businessman, T. I cannot believe this. The hard-working entrepreneur is getting shit from a guy so lazy he retired in his 30s. And then from this other guy whose sense of entitlement is so strong, he asks, how far we had to travel when he's offered a job he ain't even qualified to do. This is why the country is screwed. There's not enough me's, there's too many you's. Yeah, a country full of you's. That's just what this world needs. Shit would get done. It would be Darwinian. Hey, look, dude, we helping you out. But if you think you'd be better off on your own... No, 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 hey, look, hey, the God. Oh, just let's calm down, all right? We have a score to take. There is profit to be made. I mean, don't that beat getting picked up by G-Men and forced to work for free? Yeah, 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 all right. Talk us through exactly what's going on. We're going out to Sandy Shores. I know that part. My guys will meet us there. They'll have the submarine. I'm going to get into said submarine that... Wait, hold on. You had the flying lessons, right? Hey, I came prepared. I didn't know what I was preparing for, but I'm feeling pretty confident in the air. Good, 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 good. Hey, what's the next part of the plane? There's an army chopper at the airfield. You're both getting into it. Michael's flying. He's gonna take off, pick up the submarine with me in it, and <clears> fly it <throat> out to a point off the coast. You're gonna drop me into the ocean. I'll pilot the sub down to find the device the government's been testing. I'll get it, surface, you'll fly me back to the airfield. What kind of device? What kind doesn't matter. How much will be paid for it does matter. These are government scientists we're robbing. I said at the condo, the tests are being run by Meriwether Security Consulting. Ah, yes, the mercenaries. Fresh from flight. This is my advice on how to please a woman. Occasion will provide my... I think our secret oil wars should be very relaxing. If stealing a prototype like this from the government was relaxing, then everyone would be doing it. As it stands, we've got an opportunity to mint some serious coin. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. There's easier ways. And this sounds extreme, T, even for you. Can't we rethink? I mean, how deep are you into it? How deep? I've 
I've got a sub, I've got a big helicopter. I've been researching this since I got to LS. Those guys, Wade and his cousin Floyd, are expecting a paycheck. Same with my intel guy, Ron Joukowsky. Who is a damn sight better than Lester, I might add. Okay, fine, fine, I'll go along with it. Listen, Frank, if you want out, Hey! Hey! Here's the sub! Floyd, the wait! Wait in the hangar! In this is our chopper, I guess. <laughs> Just kidding! I'm gonna indulge in every... We gonna do this or what? <clears throat> you need to take off and hover low over the submarine. The rig on the chopper will connect to it. Imagine what this would be like if you hadn't taken those flying lessons. I didn't. Hover low above the submarine. Can you handle that, Michael? No. with the stick? He needs to be hovering just above the sub. Get the chopper over the submarine and they'll hook together. Shut up. Oh my fucking god. Hover over me and it'll connect. We are hooked up! You gotta drop me a couple clicks out to see from Polito Cove. Trevor, you got your company name sprayed all over this chopper. But, uh, everything else about it says military. Yep, I got it from the military base. And there's all this military hardware in the back. Guns and whatnot. Mm-hmm, this thing gets hot, they'll come in handy. Hey, I thought it wasn't getting hot. You said no major heat. In fact, you guaranteed it. It's a score, Michael. Even if you don't anticipate heat, you prepare for it. That's the code. That's why I don't take scores. Not anymore. I'm out of the game, man. What am I doing? Oh, really? You don't take scores? No, not anymore. What say you, Franklin? I say this is a conversation between you two. So. That wasn't you guys then at the Rockford Hills Jewel Store. Hey, that's right around the corner from my house, T. I might have been there buying something for Amanda. I certainly wasn't robbing it. Oh, okay, oh my mistake, my mistake. It was a, a pretty tight job, though, eh? I mean, the, the planning was there. They went in, right? They got out clean. I mean, there were some problems, but they kept their heads, right? Yeah, they yeah, pulled it off. All right, all right. It was us. Of course it was us. Any other clowns would be in Bolingbrook now. Mm, nah, there were some weak points. I mean, whoever fed that cheesy line to the parking guy. That guy? Amateur! Yeah, show us how it's done then, T. If you're such a professional. Jeff Ryan along the coast. This whole thing ain't got nothing to do with our thing. <clears throat> Trackify app ain't active yet, fellas. The app is live. I'm reading the signal.
pick up the signal? <sighs> it's relaying the diagnostics from this thing. Come on, get to it, man. An ex-army helicopter hovering by this platform's gonna raise suspicions. The lights. Oh, the lights are on. You see anything interesting? Ah, uh, just rocks so far. It's full of shit. Get me. All right, we're 
Now let's go back to Sandy Shore. What the fuck? Push the stick, Michael. We gotta move. Because I found this thing using an app on my phone, which means the private army guarding it can find it pretty easy, too. Really, Trevor? That's just great. See, I told you I got it. No worries. I got it on my first try. And here they are! Merryweather boats coming at speed. Franklin, grab one of those guns and get those guys off our ass!
I'll do what I can. What was that, T? I told you! That was Merriweather! Those choppers! Man, that ain't normal private security guards! Yeah, you're right! I have it on good authority that they're actually a lizard army who've taken human form to do the bidding of the New World Order. I hope you can flip this thing fast, because I don't want to see those reptile buddies of yours ever again. I'm rattling in here! Roger that. Hey. Oh, I meant to push E and I pushed F. Oh, fuck me. Oh, and good to see you, too. <clears throat> What's it been, huh, ten years? After this, the government won't care how long it's been. They're gonna put you and everyone you ever knew on their kill list. And yeah. you, I thought you would be smarter than this. What'd I do? Stealing a super weapon to sell to the Chinese. Damn, T. This some nuke or some shit? I thought you said you spoke to him. Yeah, I did. Okay? Kind of. I mean, he was all woozy and shit. It doesn't matter, all right? It's done. We've got it. Well, we could put it back. You drop it in the sea by the time they get a salvage operation together. No! Oh, so you want a drone circling your trailer? We'll get you another score, Trevor. You owe me! Wait, get in that chopper. Listen to whatever this fucking moron has to say. Okay! All right, and on that note, I'm out of here. You won't be seeing me back here in a long time. Hey, we need a score, remember? Man, I thought I was done not getting paid for these licks. Hello? Me too. He has anger problems. What? I spoke to Steve. We're ready to move. He wants us to bring the stuff to the guy we met at the interrogation, Devin Weston. Big time investor, apparently. Now I'll let you handle that. Brown nose and the rich was always your talent, and it looks like you spent the last decade honing it. God. Ah, Brother O'Neill. Fuck you, man. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're the guy stealing contracts. You burnt the farm, killed my brothers. You had too many brothers. They needed culling. You're fucking dead. Aren't we all? We live and we die. That's our curse. Hey, you want to expedite the situation? Come fucking find me. Vespucci Beach, Los Santos, you inbred hillbilly fuck! I'll be there, man! I don't know when, but I'll be there!
I want to end. <laughs> okay, so go. Like your house or something. That's what I'm drinking. Mine's kind of cooling off and it's kind of gross, but. Two problems can arise. A study in duality by Dr. Ray D'Angelo Harris. There you go. There you go. Many are called, but few are chosen correctly out of a police lineup. 
I choose you, call it. Speak to me. I'm on with me. Hey, man, I'm calling you from jail. Dad? Is that you? Hello? Dad? Uh, no. You know you don't know who your dad is. I know that one day he's... <clears throat> so we really finna do this shit? We finna risk our lives to rob some motherfucking government killers again? Yep. Hey. Hey, hey. Hey, Listen up. Here's the plan. Hey, Trevor. Yeah? I want you in this position up here. Okay, you're on lookout. Give me a heads up when the armored car comes by. Okay. Yeah? I'm gonna be right here, in the garbage truck blocking the roadway. Franklin, you're in the alley, in a tow truck. Hope is, they pull right up in front of you. When they do, you come at them hard. Bam. Shit, <laughs> here's hoping. Yeah, after the hit, we blast open the doors, grab up all the cash, bonds, whatever it is, I take it to Haynes' guy. It's all a little hope for home. As long as I am not on the ground when the shit goes down, okay? When the shit goes down, we'll handle it. You stay up here, <sighs> on your post, eyes peeled. Yeah. Okay? We'll take the risk. Sound cool? Shit, you the professional, dog. And at least we're not wearing clown outfits. There's a plus. Right. The masks. What? <laughs> Let's see what we got here. Huh? Real professional. <laughs> Let's do this. Go, go. I'm in position. What's the ETA? Where are they? I got a visual on the target. Should be with you any moment. Huh. Michael, you better get on your way. <clears throat> get the truck in position. Block both lanes of traffic. truck and keep it stationary. All right, I pulled up. Get ready, Frank. Did Public Works change their schedule? Ram speed, bitch! I got 
Michael. He fucking went down the stairs. I had him on top of the roof. F, stay in cover there. I'll be up here with a rifle. Shit, we ain't gonna clear the area. All right, we hold the cops. Make a play when we see a window. Hey, man, we sitting ducks right here.
Sniper's there going down. Clear, clear. Shooter two is down. Sniper's are gone. We're clear. They're coming from the left. Alright, man, you stay safe. Is it? Is it boring? Training is usually boring. Destroyed the truck. So I can actually start looking and see if I want to keep doing this job. Yeah, I get it. I get it. I didn't mean to do that.
That was good. Now I'm a liberal because you have to be in the entertainment industry. I'd much rather be chewing tobacco, grabbing my nuts, mistreating women, wearing a wife beater shirt. Got a package for Devin Weston. Package for Mr. Weston. Come on. He's a I ain't fucking giving it to yeah, you. Yeah, and I'm telling you that I don't give a flying fuck. <laughs> there you go, there you go. Boom! So long, motherfucker! Devin Weston. Yeah, I remember you. The weekend interrogator. Invest wisely. Hey, hey, hold on, hold on. We're not done here yet. I got a job for you, bro. Five top quality scores. Big ticket cars. Major payday, bro. Sounds great. I got just the guy for you. I'll put you in touch. No, 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 no. I don't want just some dude. I want you. I want your crew. I want pros on this. Yeah, I don't give a fuck what you want, pencil neck. <laughs> I let them know you're interested. <laughs> I guess I just got you figured wrong, man. Hey, what's the figure? Tell me something. You like football? I got a stake in a sports investment venture. You like the market? I got some funds you can manage. Name your poison, man. I just like sitting around watching old movies. Oh, there we go. How about I hook you up with Solomon Richards? Bullshit. Solomon Richards, the movie producer? Yeah, he's retiring, man, and I'm doing a finance deal for his studio. 
I will make the connect just as soon as you. All right. Oh, man. Solomon Richards. Have a good one, boys. Hey man, listen, I got an interesting opportunity for you. An acquaintance of Dave's. An FIB contact? Are you joking? Relax, the guy's private sector. Very wealthy. Could be lucrative. Why don't you meet him and see what you think? <sighs> all, right, all, right, all right, yeah, yeah, I'll think about it. All right, me and Trevor will be there too. I promise you, it's a step up for you. A real opportunity. Is he on the phone? He is. Great, here's someone we all really love. I guess we'll go here. Um, you are really wowing us with your new show, Jimmy Boston. How's it going, Jimmy? Yeah, everything's going great. It's a great show. Really great. I told my agent I wanted something serious and character driven, but that also shows I've got great ass. So yeah, Life Bar 3D is a fantastic career move. That's just great. Yeah. Movies are overrated. TV? It's where it's at. Oh, yeah. I'd love to get you on my show. Maybe you could come on and sing with me like a duet. <sighs> Man, it's so great that you're doing something more meaningful. Uh, Jimbo, you know, we could grab a drink sometime, hit the town. I know some part, amazing underground clubs where seen. celebs like me and you hang out. Finger groupies. Thanks, Laszlo. Thanks a lot. I just Listen, need to cool build I love that you do that I whole radio hosting. Really yeah. funny stuff. And normally yeah. ugly guys sort of act all shy, but you've got lots of personality and you're really funny, yeah. I think. Anyway, glad you love the show. Peace. Kiflon. Oh, uh, not another one. These Absalon guys are taking over. I think he blew you off there. That's a brilliant yeah. short slide. I didn't even want you to be a cameo on Lifeguard. Your career could be out swimming and get into trouble and need rescuing. You've got no friends, Laz. Please, I would be amazing on that show. I would totally wear a banana hammock. I've got friends, Michelle. Lots of friends. And we all hang out banana hammocks together. Wow, it sounds amazing. I'd love to get involved. You have friends? Call one. I would totally rotisserie you. Ew! Oh, I feel soiled. It's fun. You should try it. And you know what? Maybe I will call one of my friends. Look at this address book on my phone. Packed with friends. Look, it's my friend Reed. Maybe I'll call Reed, but you know, later. People don't want to hear from my friends. Man, I was out last night partying. Oh, good times. Bottle service. Well, I mean, I snuck the bottle in, but... God. And there's nothing like taking advantage of a lonely divorcee from the Midwest while she quietly weeps to let you know that you're a star on television. The chicks love it. You really are a man. That made me very sad. That entire monologue was, well, it was disgusting. And she's probably crying because it was over in 60 seconds. Who cares? <laughs> I got mine. I busted a nut. Please don't use that black scent again. And you really hate women. Ball all you want. Sorry, Mother Nature made your private parts so tedious. Ugh. Anyway, we've got another celebrity calling in. Someone you can really relate to. An actor and a reality TV star, Tyler Dixon. No, come on, man. I just got that mic.
fantastic. I mean, the pop video awards? Hey. So relevant, so controversial. Yeah. Come in, come in. Thanks. You must be Michael. Yeah. You know, I used to have three secretaries. Now I have to make my own coffee and give myself a happy ending. <laughs> See, the ships are coming in. But the walls will hold us. Nelson in Naples. Pluto? I said Mars, you cocksucker. <laughs> Shoulder of Orion. Two. Devin Weston said you were a fan. Huge fan. Tell me, Michael, Devin Weston, did he, does he want you to bump me off? No, not at all. What? He said you were retiring but might need some help on a movie. Only assholes retire, Michael. Him and my son, they want to put me out to pasture so they can turn this place into condos or a theme park or something. But this place is a dream factory. Well, maybe they have different dreams. Some days, I don't blame them. You know, they always say, never work with children or animals. Well, I want to add to that list. Never work with directors or actors. This picture is going to kill me. All right. So what's it about? It's perfect. And family. Set in Liberty City. <clears throat> Meltdown. <laughs> it's all being shot on green screen right out back there. We take a look at the financial crisis, and then we boil it all down into a really simplistic battle between two yuppies. With lots of training montages. So what's the problem? Milton McElroy. I cast him in the second lead because he's cheap. Zero talent, incidentally. Well, he's got this new agent, Rocco Pelosi. He's been hassling us about renegotiating the deal, so now, He's holding up shooting until he gets paid. That sounds problematic. It would be if the director wanted to shoot. Anton Baudelaire. Ever heard of him? That doesn't surprise me. Now he's having a mental breakdown, pissing all over himself who knows where. <sighs> all right. Looks like you got yourself that new assistant. Mm. But no happy endings. <laughs> I love you already. <laughs> Go to uh, east our center. Oh fuck it's back. Oh it's right there, that's right. Eat machine coffee! I'm stressed! I love this town! You know, you can be smug about the rest of the country and live in a vacuum pretending that there's an endless supply of revenue to just hand out to people. Hey, Solomon. I'm just doing that thing. Good, good. Now, I realized just in my excitement, I forgot some details. Yeah, it seemed obvious. You want this Pelosi guy clipped. No, God, no. Is that an option? No, no, no. Bad idea, bad idea. No clipping anyone. Just teach him some manners. He's also in my director's ear as well if you'd believe it. So teach this punk a lesson and bring the talent back to set, ideally in a more collaborative mood. I'll see what I can do. They all gonna be at the club? I'm told it isn't a club so much as a rat pit. Anton and Milton are supposed to be there, and Pelosi's on the way to pick them up. He's taking them to his lawyer to sign the contracts, so if he hears there's someone from the studio coming, he'll get them out fast. All right, I'll go in quiet. I see you on the set, boss. Boss. Boss man. Marching bands with your matching Napoleonic costumes, turning rock classics into the garbage. You fucking dick. Hey, I'm driving. You think a stadium full of drunks cares about your stupid song? We want to see bitches shooting t-shirts. Oh, look at me. Yeah, bitches doing something. You need help, dude. At least I'm not pretending to be someone half my age. Good point, Marshall. He got you there, Laz. Speaking of lost souls who need a 
bunch of help. I think we have the perfect guest for you. Laszlo, introduce. Come on, uh, turn up the. Uh... <clears throat> Coming up on Chattersphere with Laszlo and Michelle. It's... Michelle and Laszlo. That is what I said. It's not. Well, whatever. Let me speak. Being saddled with a woman to appeal to more liberal listeners. I am liberal. Seriously. I've got a TV show, which makes. So shush, woman. Coming up next, what are we? Uh, oh, not this again. God, I gotta take this producer out and piss on their head. How original. A cult leader in Los Santos. I, I mean, a promoter of alternative thought. Coming up next on Chattersphere with Michelle and Laszlo, alternative therapy life coach, committed spiritualist, and senior lay preacher of the Children of the Mountain Fellowship, Brother Adrian. Brother Adrian, welcome to the show. Hello, my child. My children, both of you. Welcome to the now. So good to have you on the show. Yeah, it makes a real break from the Ooh, whack jobs nice. and crazies I normally interview. You know, our guest Booker gets us celebrities, but the, the publicist makes us take these has-beens and, and won't be. I don't remember this one. Don't think. You like this space? It's gonna be an EDM paradise. It's gonna be sparklers stuck in bottles, implants, tramp stamps, all the real shit. That's Pelosi Entertainment. Now give me a minute here. Just a minute. I gotta go grab something inside. Yanni, we nearly got the club. We're finally a go. Now you take care of these guys. No pole beach. Okay? Let's go. The helicopter with the Where is the stairs? Paycheck every week, keep at it. If he tries to pay monthly or asks for credit, then you get out. He tried to pay me with X bills at the start. What am I gonna do with a pound of X? This rock. Going. What are you up to? Gentlemen, you're going back to set. Oh, who's this? Who's this jackass? Hey, you! I mean, it's a little oh, Turns out, these guys are in love with their contract. So All my characters are. Can you believe this fucking clown? No! This that guy's all mine! Dope. <laughs> Make a new 
deal. You leave my people alone, and I don't toss you off this roof. All right, yeah. Okay, sure, man, sure. All right. Let's get back to the lot. Yeah. Whoa, whoa, hey! Look, you can bully him, but you can't bully Talon. I'm not going to until I get a new deal. Can't I'm on a gaming Talon? laptop. Just Sweet. You're going to be a good boy when I'm done. I don't know who you think you are. Just jumped up to studio security? I ain't security. I'm Solomon's assistant. Help! Was scaring them. Look, can I just say I was just in this for the promise of strong drugs? I don't want a new deal. So much has to be off the show entirely. Well, I've got a feeling you might want to reconsider as well. Can we just talk this through? You gotta think about this, man. And let's talk, honest to honest. Enough. Uh, enough! Alright, I'll do the shitty movie <laughs> for the shitty money. I'll do anything you want. I'll blow you and just stop! Finally, you come to your senses. I'll take you to the studio. Hey, Milton, watch. I think you owe an apology to Mr. Richards. I have never played no, story mode. Me. I've played it. Um, but I never beat the to game. I'm your apologizing. When you see Solomon, you say, Sorry for the misunderstanding, sir. And you will always, always appreciate the opportunity he's given you. Look, I just wanted a better deal. Everyone wants a better deal. Everyone serving coffee, selling cars, typing in spreadsheets wants a better deal. But you got the best deal there is. You're making movies. Yeah, you look at it that way. And then you got a huge tax bill and payments to me and a beachside bungalow with Chumash. Now, where am I putting this thing down? When Devin Weston came to do a studio visit, he used the empty water tank. All right, then we'll do the same. Put it there. The water tank to our parking lot. Setting it down. Solomon's office. Come on. Look, I'm feeling a little keyed up. How about I call my guy, go on a little jolly, and call Solomon from wherever I wake up in, in a week. I got this. I got this. You see him right now, and we go flying again if you even look <clears> like <throat> you'll fail a piss test at any point on this shoot. Oh, now he's saying they can't do drugs. surprise Anton my boy he kind of looks oh well, reminds me like the of uh, the best um, kind of art a simplistic cliche ridden pile of dross that you will turn into magic get a grip I love you so Solomon Milton here has a little something he wants to say to you say it ah uh, I, I just just want to say that I'm sorry for any misunderstanding sir and I I appreciate all the opportunities that, that, that you've given me. Of course, of course. Michael, what can I say? You're a natural. I love you. Oh, you're too kind. No, no, I mean it. I, I have to look it up. I can't it. remember But would it be name. okay if I gave you a shout? This shoot shout. seems cursed for some reason or another. A I shout. need an associate producer. I'd love that. We'll talk soon. I gotta go. Oh, hell yeah. Whew. Ah, hell yeah.
Alfred Hitchcock. That's who I'm thinking of. That's who that guy looks like to me. I'm thinking I have to steal a vehicle. Wait, what are you guys doing? We should go to the dungeon crawler. All the celebs. I'm working with Clay Jack. Show. Talk about high maintenance. Yeah, if I had a dollar for every rapper in town who wants to get into movies. That's fine, what, honey? Hey, Shelly. Gotta go. I do. See you next week. I want to get into movies. You would not believe how many celebrities live here. Oh, totally. I got one of those maps of the stars. Let me use this one. I know things. I know them. Dumb things. I know dumb things and dumb things know me and therefore dumb things don't know that I know those things. So I know mm -hmm. dumb things because dumb things is right in front of my face. I'll tell the audience. Calm yeah. down, Ray. You're getting all angry again. I wasn't disrespecting your duality. It's the smoothie you made me. I'm kind of bugging out. That's because it's Dr. Ray D'Angelo Harris bug out smoothie with spirulina, which is nature's PCP. I'm sorry, Cheryl. You know I love you. But sometimes you need to be yelled at. Mm -hmm. Oh, dude, this one right again. Now. Right now. Mm -hmm. Catching mm -hmm. in the mouth. Right now. Get that. Get, get it. Get it. Mm -hmm. I'm going to don't, 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 don't do it on the air. Don't do it. Now, look, I'm going to hum. I'm going to catch it in my hand. And I'm going to throw this um in your mouth. Open your mouth. In your mouth. Okay. Open your mouth, man. In the mouth. Oh, no, 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 um. You open your mouth. I'm going to throw you my um. And my um going to go in your mm. What's going on? You're going to dress up as traffic cops. And you're going to rob two trust fund kids that I know and dislike intensely. Uh, why? We can get a good price for the vehicles in Asia. Look, complete the work, you'll all be well paid. You're late, sugar tits. Yep. Sugar tits. So what's going on? Oh. oh, you finally get to realize your childhood dream and dress up as a cop. Mr. Weston's research team suggests the two boys like to ride on the Sonora Freeway. Sounds manageable. Hey, you two get going. Ooh, let's go, T. Dog, I don't know if this shit is for me, homie. My life's already way the fuck out of control. All right, look. I'm a Darwinist brother, all right? Some prosper and some struggle. Now, are you out of your goddamn mind? This is your lucky break. Choose. Now, are you going to do this, or have you simply found your level in life? I guess we'll find out. Yeah, I guess we will, homie. Let you 
Tell me this flight is full. I'm not gonna do it, Cheryl. I'm not gonna let you offer me $300 to get on the next available flight. I'm not gonna do it, Cheryl. You know why? Cause I wanna fly today. It ain't gonna happen, Cheryl. Not in front of my public, and not in front of my listeners, and not in front of those people out there who I'm cleansing through their ass. It's not gonna happen. You really, you are a bully, Ray. Look, girl, this, this is strong, okay? I'm sorry I went there, but sometimes I gotta go there to get there. You understand what I'm saying? I gotta go out there. This is how, this is how it works, Cheryl. Let me explain to you how it works in front of everybody, okay. in front of all my listeners. Okay. I gotta go through this airwaves, uh -huh. out to the people, touch the people. Through their ears, uh -huh. into their ears, into their brain, yes. down their down their system, the nervous system, into their chest, to the, the help their heart beat, down to their bowels, right? To stir things up in their bowels. You understand? That's a cleansing. That's a damn cleansing. They sit on that toilet bowl, side saddle, and put one elbow on that foot. Hey, Frank. Hey, I'm nearly with these dudes, man. You guys comfortable on your end? Yeah, I guess. We look pretty ridiculous. <laughs> All right, man. Look, I'll see you soon. Yeah. We'll pick you up coming through Grapeseed. Get the drivers there and get them going at speed. We are raising awareness around here. Awareness, you dumbass fool! That's all it takes, and pretty soon, shit has changed. Cause people over realize they're being aware because you're getting awareness, and you don't know you got awareness until you get the damn awareness. Don't you tell me what I'm doing here. And we have done it all by holding a protest sign, and wearing tie-dyes, and smoking sheeple. That's not actually I'm telling you, 2.7 millimeters. What the fuck does hey, how about we see which one of you two is for real? So get in your cars and let's see if they move as fast as your mouth. Ooh, Ooh the fool wants to race what? us. We were just getting out of here anyway. <laughs> All right. I don't think this car is going to keep up with those. Why are we going in the opposite way? There we go. They have to activate special ability. Oh yeah. What exactly am I supposed to do? Just race them? What the fuck? Hey, we coming up now, man. Beat it in a few seconds. Got it. Whatever. Here they come. 
I'll tell you about that later. Oh, shit. Same. You know how fast you were going? Gee, I don't know, officer. I uh, try to keep it under the limit. Well, you sure boys look like you were drag racing from where we were sitting there. So uh, why don't you get yourself out of the car? Come on, Come on. officer. Officer. Is this officer. Entirely necessary. Yes, it is. Get on. Come on. Hands on the car. Let's go. Come on. Get out of the fucking car. Hey. 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 What are you doing? All right, we got to make sure. Get out of the fucking car, you pipe-tight I'm trying to stay. Prick. You, you little I'm shit. Get to the diet. fuck out of here. Yeah. God. Hey, man, you know how hard it was to drive slow enough to stay with these fools? Let's have a real race. Well, you talk a good game. Okay, just don't scratch the car. I mean, good for you for doing the diet, though. Speak. Ah, the lady from before. Devin's assistant. Good to be working with you. It's Molly Schultz, Senior Vice President and General Counsel to Mr. Weston's Holding Company. And if you think it's good to be working with common thieves, well, you're very mistaken. Have you got the cars? Wow, the whole resume. Yeah, we got the cars. Bring them to Hayes Auto on Little Bighorn in South Los Santos. Mr. Weston and I will meet you there. Hey! Just spoke to Devin's man, woman, lawyer person. I'll be waiting at Hayes Auto in South LS for you idiots to show up. Yeah, right. Hey, Frank. Yeah. What'd I tell you, bro? These cars. <laughs> this is an opportunity. Yeah, if you say so. You know what, right before I met you, I was boosting rides and racing. It feels like it come full circle to me. Come on. 
Fantastic. One kid and two old creeps. Who the fuck would have thought it? Gentlemen, move the vehicles. Hey, gimme five, five, and five. Oh, hey, chest kiss, homie. Boom. Dog, come on, man. Chest you got kiss. The fucking paper? Absolutely. Look, you finish the job, you get the paper. But the order was for five cars. If I'm not mistaken, that's only two. Just give me the fucking money now. Oh, I'm so scared. I really, really am. But you know what? I'm a payment on completion of work type of guy. You don't like the job? Take a fucking walk. Hey, right, come on, man. Hold on. So what's next, man? Well, it's the Z type. Chad Mulligan. Lay it on him, kid. Mulligan's a record producer. He's going through a messy divorce. He's hiding his valuable assets, including the car, so that makes it complicated. He'll clock any ground surveillance we run. All we've got to go on is that the car's in a lockup in Howick. So we just go house to house? Not quite. We have access to an LSPD helicopter. The computer on board can ID pedestrians from a chip in their driver's license. Find Mulligan and Howick, follow him to the lockup, someone on the ground collects the car. All right, so who does what? You're not needed for this job. Phillips, you're in the chopper. Clinton, you're on the ground. Yeah, I don't understand the deal between you two. Yeah, well, I don't understand the deal between you two either. But you know what? Life! It's just one long mystery. Bye bye gentlemen, and stay spiritual. Oh, and Michael, I'll be in touch about your friend, Solomon. All right, good. Alright, 
I'll be right back. Hey, how's it going? Um, I average three. Depending on the day.
Um. How are you doing? Yeah. Four more and then now I might be affiliated. Boop. Michael, uh, I haven't heard from you. I trust you're keeping in fine mental health. But I worry. Phone session? Phone session. This is Dr. Isaiah Friedlander. I can't come to the phone right now. If you've been trusted Even with the premium you... rate emergency line, call it. Just call it. Just message. Way into my possession. I'm looking. I don't know what I'm looking for. Need a vehicle. <clears throat> My God, I want to eat some junk food without eating. Grapes. <laughs> Eating grapes. I like grapes. I that's what I went up for. Is I went up for coffee and I went to go look for junk food. But I don't have any. There's, oh there's the L. All this stuff is for I like grips too, but I want to eat junk. Yeah, that's usually how it goes. I imagine you like grips, otherwise you want to have grips. <laughs> what did he do? Did Van come in here to tell me, man, I wonder what you're sitting at for average viewers now and tell me that I have four, four more, I need four more followers. And then he just leaves? Comedy, if you've given enough time. Rehab Island. We put Darwinism into the ultimate struggle as people. Oh, damn. Go get the family feet down. Oh. 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 Move, move, will ya? You messing with the ring, yet? Asshole. It's time to throw them down. Oh yeah. Is a pro football team finally coming to Los Santos? It's Roundhouse at the Italians. Coffee, cookies, kiflon, and payment plans. Milton McElroy tells world he is happy and creative. Pro 
football in Los Santos. It sounds like a pipe dream where you inhale deep so and what the is... world disappears around you. Can't do that to reality, if the state will agree to enough taxpayer incentives, we'll stay on this story. Cult news. It's called a truly American religion, obsessed with celebrities, preying on weakness and offering many payment plans. The Epsilon program's Chris Fromage recently defended the religion. The question is, do the rich, famous, and good-looking become Epsilonists, or do we Epsilonists become rich, famous, and good-looking? Well, it doesn't really matter because we have the answers to it all. Available in easy-to-understand payment plans. Who better to teach... These are... Franklin, right? Is it green? Young people about self-worship, swinging, giving up their identity and freeing themselves from conscience than celebrities. In movie news, actor Milton McElroy dismissed reports he is unhappy on the set of Meltdown, a troubled picture being shot on green screen over at Richard's Majestic's lot. He said that rumors he was unhappy were gross exaggerations and swore that audiences were going to love the picture. Weasel News, confirming your prejudices. This is WCTR. I am Fernando Martinez. Thank you. Thank you so much. It's great to be back. Joe, to make the clapping sound effects a little bit too loud. That's my producer, Joe, everybody. She is a woman. So what is there for him to do? Nothing. I guess we'll go home. Not a lady, not a fox, not a chick, not a piece of ass, but a woman. Now listen, for those of you who say Fernando, he's like a dinosaur, he does not understand the modern world. He is an old relic of the bygone age. I like to point out Joe is a woman. More or less, therefore, Fernando, he has gone multicultural. He is very much of this century. I am famous for many things I have been in this life. Entrepreneur, singer, therapist, artist, disc jockey, philosopher, lover, corporate spokesman, martyr for justice and truth that lives in every man and woman's heart when I was unfairly imprisoned for entirely unproven allegations. In short, I understand life and life understands me. I have been chosen to help guide you down these crazy rabbits. After my show was taking off the air, now I am making money by talking about you. And making money by talking about politics. Excuse me. Also, because I am the new man, no longer do I talk about grabbing the girl by the haunches, riding her like a pampas bull, and sating her every manly desire. No. 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 Those days, they are gone. The medallion, she is off. The children, they have a mommy and daddy to look up to. And I am not making inappropriate remarks by letting my passionate gaze linger on Joe's remarkable form. Not for a second. Oh, shut up. You see, I take the classes, the awareness classes, the 21st century classes. Now I know I... Never gonna get used to the silence. To my darling, I hope you choke on this, Amanda. <clears throat> How sweet. Ooh, pizza. He needs to do some dishes.
This is America. Our fires burn bright, especially in the trash barrels that keep people warm. Or after a riot because there's no jobs. Bad. Yes, We're at Rhodes, wondering if this country can ever come back from the abyss while bankers loot the coffers. The thing about steel, it's hot and cold at the same time, like a woman. We'll do some yoga. This is make me oh, want to do yo yoga again. <laughs> I uh, never done it. Okay. Can I switch to them yet?
Game crashed. That was weird. But um, not surprising. I played this for 18 hours, or well, I got 18 hours on it. Hmm. Weird. So it says that I have one point nine one out of three average viewers in the last thirty days. But I think my 30 days is coming up and it will change. And I have 154 hours. In my boxing gear, um, do I have one on my computer? I just got this computer, so I have to go to like 
another social media to see if I can find one. <clears throat> Why is my caps on? Okay. What the hell? I know I had at least one. Oh, she wants she wants to uh, see a picture of me in my boxing gear when I was in boxing, Golden Gloves. I can't find a picture of it, and I have, according to this, um, according to this, I have. Who watches? Who watch? Who watches? The watchers, one point nine, one point nine one out of three. Can block no. Did he? That's not good. How did he die? Snowmobile accident? Damn. I know a guy who, uh, oh, my game crashed. That's why you're not seeing my computer. Um, right? 
I know a couple of people that were in snowmobile accidents, and one had has permanent brain damage because he crashed into a tree. Those things are dangerous. The other one was wearing a helmet, and I don't know exactly what happened. I think he was riding in a ditch on, like, on the side of the road, and he hit one of those culverts, like one of the skis went in. <clears throat> so it like, was an instant stop, and he blew over and smashed his head on the ground. And he was wearing his helmet, so it bounced off the packed snow, and he like, he didn't die, but he broke his neck. I'm not sure at the moment what happened, but it must have been bad. Yeah. Well, it never is good. <laughs> yes, sad even more now. What's going on with you? How how are you doing? Other than. I mean, for the stuff you That's good. I'm happy to hear that. Yeah, if you ever need anything, just, just let me know and I'll try to do my best to help you out. You want to up your running game? Run like a caveman. Finally, shoes are getting back to nature. Going through shit alone is never... I mean, sometimes you just need to have alone time, but it's never good to just do it by yourself. Especially when you're just chasing your own tail. I understand. But yeah, I have a, and I have a hundred and fifty four hours in thirty days. It says, it says on this that for built a community, reach fifty followers. It says I have forty five, but this says forty six. So one must be a uh, a bot or whatever you call them. And this one says I have. 34. <clears throat> I don't know. Yeah, I must, uh, whatever. What if you're a bot? Okay, so just need some time to focus on. Prepared for anything to happen now? Sometimes it takes a while for it to actually count. <clears throat> I mean, I haven't had a new. The la well, the last follow I had was that Z Zedel Deal, or however you pronounce it. And that was three days ago. 
<clears throat> sometimes it takes what if you're a bot what if you are a bot you don't know this whole thing could just be a simulation like grant the thought okay so mm -hmm. I'm very thorough about DNA cleanup. I'm a spiritual being, Dr. Ray. I'm just like you. Oh, 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 damn it, Dr. Ray. You're not oming with me. I feel your pain, my brother. We are all one, but some of us are also two. And that's that. Bye now. So I'll keep that freak off my goddamn show. Talking to freaks. Did I ever tell you about some nasty twins named Tammy and Sammy who had restraining orders against me after some hot yoga got out of hand? Hot yoga started and it went out of control. Weren't my fault. Damn women, it's 120 degrees. I was getting spiritual. Show sure knows, I act out when I think I'm gonna die. Oh, I'm a terrible fright. Oh, no. Damn airplane. You gotta see me fly. Oh, I'm terrible. It's true, they have to scramble the jets. Listen, we get into turbulence, I'll grab a titty. That's the first thing I'm thinking about, because that's where my mind goes sometimes. If you're gonna die, I'm gonna go down in a fetal position. Fetuses want titties. I ain't sucking no damn thumb. I'm going out the same way I came in. Everything in the universe is about to. And that again is the duality. When one becomes two, problems hey! can arise. Was, I am uh, very clear about we this in my see, watching the sure. funny video a while ago, the the and that they were talking about two, can uh, arise. white men fantasize or whatever there you go. about there you go. women's out of a police lineup. He was I'm like, well, you know, the babies, that's um, what we always wanted. Hey man, I'm that was food. Is that you? Hello? It meant to, uh, no. you know you don't know who say. your dad is. And I know that one day he's gonna hear me on the radio. It's just a uh, natural instinct. Always. All the things a father and son should do. Fishing, bike riding, three ways. Wow, Going to a farmer's a market. Wow. Beekeeping, no, organic it's honey, it's knitting. A dad and his boy, you know. Knit one. Ever heard of Jackson Skinner? He's head of product development at Facade. Man, we must read different magazines. And the bastard made a fortune selling customer data to the highest bidder from Moscow to Tehran. He's handing it to the cyber terrorists on a fucking silver platter. Okay, dog, chill. Shit, chill. I got you, man. What's the play? Well, I'm reliably I'm informed that, that he has a weakness for working up. girls. There's a regular he likes to pick up in La Puerta. You stake her out, and she should lead you to Skinner. Why? I'll send you the location. Meanwhile, maybe I'll take another look at the fruit share price. <laughs> All right, homie. I'll be in touch. I was driving and what? Yes, those are mine. Stop interrupting! It's rude. What's latency? Oh, this is awful. What's wrong with my landline anyway? Have you fallen down a well, brother? I will pull you out and we can drink up that water together even though you have most likely polluted the groundwater. Like you've been fretting yourself right. I'm really into Zen and Omen and yoga and I want to get married to a woman who will be there for me when I get out in 2025. We can have a baby while I'm in prison. One inmate told me you can smuggle your own baby bat out if you hold it under your tongue and exchange it with a family member in the meeting room. Anyway, I know I've made mistakes. I want someone I can grow old with and brutally murder in our golden years. I think you need some body whisperer. Dr. Ray D'Angelo Harris is a spiritual body whisperer. Um, um. Hang on. <clears throat> I gotta allow the word bitch. Uh, there's a slight delay on the video. I can see my 
testing, which is super. I, uh, without saying too much, one time I had a what are you doing? court I'm hearing, mm. and it was over webcam, it relaxes myself and, and the ladies. it was like you that, see, there was a slight mm. delay, it's a scientific frequency I that lulls myself. the ladies into a relaxed spiritual place, where the brain shuts off, and the thighs go into overdrive, mind off, body on, it's like trying to start a car, z -z 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 -z. Z -z 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 -z. Z -z 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 -z. That mind is the battery. That battery is drained and dead. But the engine's good, right? You see it, yeah. I can Damn, you. that must be my girl. Hi there, beautiful. You wanna party with me? Not today, honey. I'm waiting for someone. I still enter the car. Watch for the vehicle. The chance is kill the driver. But if I drive up. No browsing. It's bye now or bye bye, honey. Yeah, yeah, I hear you. <laughs> I realize I. Damn, that I'm must doing. be my girl. Hi there, beautiful. You want to party with me? Not today, honey. I'm waiting for someone. Dude, you have fucking all that lane over there. Instead, see, you know, I wouldn't feel bad about it. Hey, man, I'll wipe that software for you. Ah, excellent news. I'll speak to you soon. I'm a train. My mom said it can be anything, so I became a subway. And not the sandwich.
<laughs> on the subway sandwich. You'd probably eat people. I might like that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'd be all sorts of cards. That's dumb luck right there. Five guys. Six guys. <laughs> Get out. I want out of this hole. Jeff Yama is the type of dude to complain to the manager. Says Los Santos is vapid, depressing, and superficial. Yeah, but anyone would have a brain, that too. <laughs> but you got half a brain, don't you? He is. He is with me. I made it. Level. It was real cool. Play some Tibetan rugby, eat some cheese interest. or toast. Real Tibetan style, too. With legs off. Crossed for real. Anyway, let's wind down the show with the final yoga pose for the intense session, Savasana. It's actually Shavasana. Shavasana. Don't correct me. I'm a yogi woman. Yes. Shavasana. 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 I know Shavasana. Or cross pose. Sure, join me. Come here in a big rave, yoga mat, girl. Lay down like a corpse, like you did as a doornail. Lay there like you just got shot 
or died on a finger food voyage on the street. I love me fresh corpse. So relaxing. You relax with me out there. You relax, Cheryl? You look stiff. Corpse aren't stiff, you understand? Okay, I don't really know what all this means. Shh. Stare at the ceiling and shut up. Um, <laughs> your brain. Yeah. Like, go in your head right now. Let it close your eyes. Go in your head. Get a whisper room. You know what a whisper room is? You eventually you'll see uh, a barber on TV and after you cut your hair, he whisper room you off. Mm -hmm. Your hair off your body. Yeah. Take a whisper room and whisk your brain out your head. Damn your it. Thoughts. Now I want to sub. So who the fuck don't you like today? Guys called Isaac Penny, ruthless vulture capitalist, about to take a controlling interest in Vapid Motor Company and sell thousands of workers down the river. Penny's uh, one of those tight-fisted billionaires, rides the same bus to and from work every day. I was thinking you could take over the route and... Drop the ass off where he needs to go. I got it. Good. Oh, one thing. If I was you, I wouldn't buy any Vapid stock until the acquisition falls through. I driving this bus? Yep. Hey, sorry I'm late. It's my first day on the job. I hope the traffic isn't too bad. Yesterday it took me three hours to go half a mile. It's like... I can't use my phone. Would it kill you people to crack a smile? How does he know what bus stops to go to? Hey, get in, we running late.
stole one of your countless previous shows that didn't work out and yet somehow allow you to fail upwards. Man, you must have some amazing pictures of whichever executives you're blackmailing. Listen, if you're gonna fail, fail up, I always say. And you, you're not even being fair. Fair is you calling me a bitch? That was once. Or stealing my jokes? That was twice. Or interrupting Well, me? you're late, late, late. That'd be 150. Mr. Penny, ain't he? Fair hike. Forget about it. Spend thrifts. Thank you for riding LS Transit. It's been real. It's business shit. You know how it is. show I'm everywhere I'm on a billboard I'm in bathrooms then one idiotic program director on a rinky dink talk network says that I don't attract the youth <laughs> demographic well that's because they're all high so now I'm saddled with a 22 year old microblogger with typical millennial issues as a co-host green light good to go shoulder of a pirate you hate women and you won't stop quoting those dragon brain fantasy novels i like saying winch even if it is from 1402 winch. and there were dragons flying around upside down Ugh, enough of your renaissance fair speak you're ridiculous we have an incredible show today we've got who have we got let me see Brother Adrian, he runs the Children of the Mountain, that study program you keep hearing advertised. That is a cult. Why do they always give me the cults to interview? God, I'm doomed. You want to do a show in this market, it's cults and, and whack jobs and fake boobies everywhere. You're so judgmental. I'm not talking about yours. They're tiny fake. I mean, it's cute. I'd like to put little army men on them and they can have a little battle and I'd take pictures and put it on the internet. That's disturbing. It's awesome. It's pretty sexual. No, please, keep describing my rack. It's really doing things for me. Okay. You I host will. a singing contest and work on a celebrity and liberal talk show. The one thing you're not meant to have is opinion. Don't be mad at me because you've got hairy nipples. What are you talking about? I've seen them. You know what? You do the show. You're obviously so much better at radio than I am. What have you been on the air for? Six months? I love it when you sulk. I feel like your mother. Anyway, we have a great show. Before Brother Adrian, we're going to speak to a few of your favorite stars, everybody. Actor Jimmy Boston will be on the phone. Tyler Dixon, Milt. <laughs> Homie. All right, you know how to work that face recognition shit already? Well, figure it out. Mm. Okay, booting up. You can use the sticks to move the camera. Zoom in and out. It'll pick up pedestrians carrying the 2012 SA State License. If you target them, the scanner accesses the database and pulls their record. You were 
arrested my African-American friend for a minor infraction? The LSPD disgusts me! Now, it's not me. I mean, there's some bad apples in the department, but any accusation of a racist culture, uh... You wanna bullshit me? You can bullshit the freeway! We do community outreach, but we have minority quotas. Yeah, 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 your nice six got a minority quota. I should take... Look, oh, please! We come so far in the last two decades. Oh, you're lucky I can't use this thing with one hand and fly with the other. Come in, Franklin. We're in position over Howick Avenue. What's the name of the suspect? The dude's name is Chad Mulligan. All right? Chad Mulligan. Roger that. Cause I would show it cause... Come in, yeah. Franklin! Suspect not in the area! I repeat, suspect not found in the area! Alright, alright! He might be a couple blocks east of him. Roger that! Would you look at that couple? Finally! Normal, adjusted, healthy people in this horrible town! Come in, Franklin! We've got a positive ID on the suspect. I repeat, we have visual on Chad Mulligan. No vehicle in sight. All right, look, cool. We're looking for his lockup, dog, all right? Stay on him and look out. Roger that. I can't look them you with. <laughs> okay then. We have lost sight of the suspect. Might have to send pilot boy down to draw him out. Hold on, wait. You should come out from behind that building. Suspect's on foot. Okay, I see the job. I ain't far away. It's like he doesn't hear Suspect's the... Suspect's not um, walking. Appears to be accessing a small garage. Helicopter. Right, right, I'm gonna get the call. Hey, motherfucker. Near the light. 
Type Invader officer. He turned into an alley off Del Perro. Hey, where the fucking ass away? Suspect last seen near parking garage. Suggest ground team clear the building. Pilot boy! They cut down. I need to see inside the building. Slow and steady. This camera's giving me a little air sickness. I get violent when I'm queasy. Yeah, I'm sorry, I'll keep her steady. All garage exits clear. Suspect is in the building. I can't see him! Need some help here, flyboy. Where is he? Uh, you can toggle to thermal vision if you think that would help. Oh! Well, you might have just turned yourself a reprieve. You know, I think I'm developing feelings for you. Okay. I'm seeing things a little more clearly. Hey, can y'all still see me? I'm in the middle of the garage, man, right here. No, I can't see. I'm staring at it. that car for y'all. The Z-Type? Mr. Weston will be glad you caught us. He wanted to see it before we took off. We're on the way to his personal hangar at Los Santos International. I'll tell them to expect you at the gate. All right. Hey, I'm delivering the ride to Los Santos International. Hey, is the lady gonna be there? We're just a dick who ain't paying us till we get all the cars. Shit, I think they both gonna be there, dog. Devin and Molly. Say hello from me to Molly. Man, I ain't hitting on nobody for you, man. Least of all, her. Come on, why not? It's about time I settle down. Shit, man, you need like a lion tamer or some shit. This girl, man, she got balls, dog, but she needs some serious stones to handle your ass. Just say hello. <laughs> man, I ain't gonna be a part of that. After everything I've done for you, ah, you are just like Michael. So, uh, the old hanging Chad has only gone and reported that car stolen. Shit, <clears throat> and I spared this motherfucker. Attention all units, we've got a fiber city on the Delta. Vehicle's the blaster thing. I think it's right, something is on. Should've killed him. So my ex and I had a bit of a talk earlier. How did that go? Doing 
bit. That's good. That is good. I'm happy you guys are getting along. You don't, you don't need the, all that. Oh shit. Oh my fucking god. Driving with you up there watching me, dog. I get self conscious and shit. Just wanted to reach out and apologize for the that could happen. What do you mean? Can I fix the damage? Can I bring this to... Pain spray. What? Fuck. It's gonna be all fucked up. And I'm gonna get shit out of it.
Hey, I'm supposed to meet Devin Weston here. Mr. Weston's hangar is up there on the left. You know, if this beauty was a woman, I'd have to break my 20 and under rule. Man, I'll just stick to driving, all right? <laughs> hey, tell me something. You know how many of these things they made? Uh, shit, like 10? No, not like 10, man. Exactly 10. Oh, wow, man. You one of them type of dudes, huh? Tell you something. How'd you like to drive a car like this one, then, man? For real. Like this? Or this. Oh, man, right back at me, homie. Really nice. Hey, you know something? You're not like those uh, snowbird retiree pals of yours. You are sharp, man. Man, I'm just looking for a paycheck for my services. No, no, no don't worry. It'll come. That'll come. But right now, it is life lesson time, pal. You have got to wake up to what's real in this situation, bro. Take me, right? I am opportunity. I'm security. I'm fast cars, blow jobs. I got the world on a plate. Those two clowns, oh man, they are the worst kind of disaster that can ever come down. They are a full core meltdown, and you're just standing there soaking up major radiation. You have got to take stock, man. Make that call before it's too late. Yeah, all right, man. I will. Before it's too late, man. Yeah, yeah. Just take any car and go! <clears throat> That's good that you're doing better than okay. other trainees. Shows potential. I like this one. Fuck that. your perception of addiction. Weasel News. A major automotive deal falls apart after a brutal murder. A $150 million house? While you're a failure, some locals are living a high life. In the latest of a string of shocking terrorist hits on prominent businessmen in Los Santos, venture capitalist pioneer Isaac Penny has been murdered by an assassin masquerading as... Drive. As a result, I feel horrible. Oh. You still owe me a drink. Mechanic and LS do for you. That should do the trick. You got some beef with the ballas or something? Perfect installation. Is 
that street legal? Ah, who cares? to get me. <clears throat> that was kind of cool. Yeah. If that car was a woman, I'd guess her. So I ate one chocolate ball. How was that? As fruit and nuts are. Oh. <laughs> Speaking to me right now at a red light, if you say so, 55 down to 35, right? I'm gonna visualize world peace. I'm gonna go home and mm, I don't care if my woman leaves me, I don't give a damn right now. So, what I'm wearing global warming and pollution, but I don't give a crap. The news has made me an uncaring moron. I tell you what, I'm tired of. I'm gonna tell you right now. I'm tired of all the so called vegetarians and vegans in this state. I only eat raw meat. If you come back to my show and call me a fraud, I'll be. High ground! Good thinking, T. There we go. Uh, uh, 
That was higher up than I thought. becomes your greatest ally in this fight against waste. You got to compost. There be analysts up in that shit. I compost condoms. I compost people. I compost every damn thing I can. And my flowers grow. My flowers grow from that compost. My garden is rich. My garden is rich. My heart is full. Cheryl, you okay? You look over. You all right? I'm just mesmerized by these fish. What are they doing? They're swimming in the trash can. That's my new koi pond. Recycle koi. <laughs> you can learn a lot about relaxing and spirituality okay, from a Japanese uh, show. They I got just some deep people. Not just no. hibachi, getting what? them grilled shrimp <laughs> and that <laughs> rice stirred with the vegetables and stuff, and the guy puts the onions on top of the, and makes the onions <laughs> into a volcano, doing tricks and stuff you with your damn food your right in front place. of you, like a damn food circus. You got to consume the culture, Cheryl. Consume it. Literally, spiritually, uh, consume the culture, Cheryl. That's what makes us spiritual. By consuming bits of other people's culture and then holding it over the heads of others less spiritual than you. You understand? I just don't see how watching goldfish in a trash can is spiritual. It's like we're just watching living things, just these creatures swimming around in circles until they die. Don't you be back talking about Koi Pond, woman! You got me all twisted up now. My mind is going other places right now. Hold on now. You get me upset now. Now I gotta. Oh, oh that's much better. Much better. Who's on the phone? Mine six. I mean, this one is. Just take it. It's thrift store anywhere. Right. It's rude and disgusting what you say about fat people. I'm a BBF. BBF? What the hell's a BBF, Cheryl? It's a big, beautiful female. What did I say, woman? Uh, uh, about how we're calorie hoarders? About how there are starving 
hurting people and we're the problem? You called us Miss bloody me. messes that take up too much room. True, I said that? Yes, you did. You called for mandatory you know, gastro vans like for all large shit. Americans, like anyone who's a little bit bigger than you at all. And you had a mandatory vegan diet. Our society focuses too much on being skinny. It's a conspiracy by the media. I'm happy with my size. Beauty comes in all shapes and sizes, and I think everybody should be accepted for who they are. Absolute nonsense! Get off my damn show! You're screwing up my shaka! If that's one thing... Cannot stand is people screaming about how happy they are. I ain't about being happy, people. That ain't the point of nothing. Happiness can suck my fatty. It's about duality. Happiness and sadness, life and death, kindness and unkindness. That's why I called you fat. Because I love you. You understand? I called you fat because I love you. And that's why I lost my chakra on Cheryl. Because she's my sister. That's why I fired Lionel, a perfectly good producer, because he was my brother, and that is why I am two. I'm awake, I'm asleep. I'm grown, I'm a child. I'm old man, and I'm afraid of death. I'm a sleeping baby. I hate it when people say they slept like a baby. Babies sleep like shit. Need a titty to get them through the night. Sir, I'm thinking about yours right now. I don't think you'd like mine. They're like really, really hairy. You gotta pluck, girl. You got to pluck. Many a first day has been ruined when the first base is covered by folders. Touch my special place right now. Ray, we've talked about this. I'm not into you. I'm bi, but this is so inappropriate for the workplace. What? My special place is inappropriate? My heart? I'll tell you what, touch my heart. Place your hand on my central solar plexus. Huh? Let me breathe deep. <sighs> <laughs> um, eating junk food. Damn, girl, what does that sound? Once in a while, it isn't gonna. Well, actually, I can't you, afford nicotine gum, so I just actually, your a body bunch of butts needs out of it, gum and it up since and you've already it. had it. You're an addict, girl. <coughs> you is an addict. If you just you um, go cold, 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 quit cold turkey on junk food, Hi, it actually Hi, I does the opposite the of what you, you want. You've got me through some real spiritual crises in the past. I called in once before, and you told me to stop acting like a little kid and grow. What is this? It's a thing. You said you wanted work. This is work. Uh-huh. And who's the guy? You'll see. Yes? Hi. <laughs> oh. Hello. We're looking for Mr. Madrazzo. Patricia, for fuck's sake, just let him in. Right this way, gentlemen. <laughs> Patricia, get us something to drink, with you? Quickly! Hey, good to see you again, Michael. <laughs> Likewise. Uh, this is my friend Trevor. Uh, sit down. Sit, sit, sit. So what did you tell him about me, about Martin Madrazo? Martin's an old friend of mine, Trevor. The truth. Martin is a terrifying psychopath who tried to kill me. Exactly. Uh, but some people, they no longer fear me as much as they used to, people who wear clothes to me. Uh, my cousin, uh, you met in Michael. Uh. <laughs> well, apparently, he's thinking about oh, testifying okay. against me. So I have him killed. I'm going to. Huh? By you. Our debt was settled. This is a favor. For a friend. What does friendship mean nothing these days? Ah, uh, hello? What's the deal? This is him. Javier. He's flying off to Liberty City this afternoon. <whistles> and he's taking some... Files of mine. Innocent files that um, I need back. There's a gun set up in the hills. I have a man watching at the airport. We'll let you know, and when he flies by, 
shoot him down, and get the files back. A man, what's up, pay? <laughs> huh? Trevor, come on. You still want to drink? Not now! Pendeja! Que no ves que estoy hablando con las gentes aquí? All right. You grab a vehicle, something personal. I'll handle the gun. All right. Hey, let's stay in touch on the headsets. record producer Chad Mulligan narrowly escaped with his life when his $3 million Z-Type was stolen in a violent carjacking. The whereabouts of the rare vintage car, one of only 10 still in existence, and the identity of the assailant are unknown. Police responding to neighbors' complaints found five rotting corpses in a condo in Polito Bay up in Blaine County. The four men and one woman were apparently involved in a sex and drugs orgy that went badly wrong. The woman, Ashley Butler, from Alderney and four local men ranging in ages from 53 to 85 all had histories of drug and legal problems. Dramatic stinger. Workers at an iFruit phone store in Liberty City say they are worried about superfan Sean Douglas. He has been in line for weeks awaiting the release of the new phone. Douglas has promised to stay in line regardless of illness, acts of God, or natural disasters. Local Los Santos funeral homes are getting in on the latest craze, adventure funerals. Why be in a casket during the viewing when your body can be involved and posed on a motorcycle or in a sea kayak the alligator pulled you out of? Mike! And Mike, you there! I got some poor bastard's dirt bike! Yeah, okay, well, I ain't at the observatory yet. Start heading that way. By the way, I know why you took me there, to that guy's house. Understood. Understood what? That he's a terrifying psycho and that you might have that in common? What is it? We gotta work for him. We don't gotta work for anyone, but I read you, man, loud and clear. What are you talking about? All that Aztec stuff, those weird little artifacts. What? The little fertility statues, whatever. The guy has trouble getting it up. We'll clear two, three million on those. Easy. Perverts will pay anything for hope. We weren't casing the joint. We didn't agree to a fee for this job. So what's it all about? Okay. The guy lives well. That don't mean we're robbing him. But it does mean he's got money to pay people who help him. When the time comes, he'll do the right thing. If he don't, please, let me handle it. You don't get a wife like that without being rich and an asshole, right? Oh, fuck. The conversation is just the best. the diet you're doing. So why do it? Alright, I see the van with the gun in it. You nearby? Not far out. Shoot the plane down and I'll be ready. If you could see this gun, it might convince you Martin Madrazo ain't someone to be messing with. The fancier the gun, the bigger the pussy who owns it. Now take down the jet. Which jet? There it is. Out past downtown. The jet's moving. Gotta give a lead.
Come on, come on. Fuck. Gotta take another shot. Nope. Damn. That's hard. Let me get more of Too much shit. <clears throat> I got her. Southwest of the city. Gotta shoot in front to compensate for the speed of the jet. That'll go down next time. Plane's coming down. You on it? Oopsie. We're plugged into the air traffic control channel. Keep me updated. Yep, keep talking. Lane ain't following the road. I gotta go cross country. Flight November 9 or Charlie Echo. Our engine number two is blown. Roger November 9 or Charlie Echo. Fly heading 240. Stay your souls on board. <laughs> what is the bike? Flight November 9 or Charlie Echo. Stay your souls right on. on board. Two souls on board. Engine two totally lost. All hydraulics lost. <coughs> All hydraulic <coughs> systems are gone. Just follow the smoke. How can you lose the plane? There you go! Son of a bitch. The pilot's fighting it, but he's going down. Good. Stay on him. We need the files. How you doing out there? We still got him? I'm on him. He's past the airfield. Landing ain't gonna be pretty. Where are you putting it down? Can you make the Alamo Sea airfield? Can't pull it around. Gonna have to put it down in the field somewhere. Gotta beat the train. Beat the train. Beat the train. Yeah. We have no hydraulic systems. No elevator control. Very little aileron control. Serious doubts to make your landing strip. Need to ditch. Roger, November 9 and Charlie Echo. You lost your manual flight control system. All your flats. How's business, Ronald? Okay, this guy is going down any minute. Good. Let's hope you don't take 
Everything they farm out here is methamphetamine. Ah, Trevor Phillips country. God, I miss it out here. You gotta come visit sometime. Yeah, you know what? I'm good. Yeah, that's what I would say. Too. I'm gonna have to bring it down in dirt. God help us. Roger, November 9 to Charlie Echo. What is your status? God help us. That's that's his status. Oh shit. They're in the dirt. Good. I missed Get the, the crash. God damn it. Take him out. Sure thing, but seriously, bro, coming all the way out here, we gotta get paid. Just do the job. I'll get us paid down the road. Put you out of your misery. Madrezo and explain the human cost of this errand. Oh, take it easy, man. Listen to me. We'll talk about that later. I want you to just drop off the files. I gotta get rid of this rifle, then we'll talk. What? There's been a change of plans. You don't need to come to the ranch. Meet me at Stoner Cement Works, a little up Sonora Road from there. What are you doing, Trevor? Nothing you wouldn't do. Trevor! Trevor! Ah. I wouldn't do. Somehow I don't believe that.
<clears throat> what the fuck? happened why do you have his car Man, a piece of turd huh no wonder people are stabbing him in the back what happened cheap bastard you know i really don't know why you mess around with people like that mike i mean really i Turn. don't answer a fucking question i asked for a fair day's pay after a fair day's work then he kind of got a little angry so i admit i kind of got a little angry did you kill him what kind of fucking animal do you take me for? No, I didn't kill him. Oh, fuck. But I did kidnap his wife. Oh, no. Oh, shit. What the fuck did you do? Oh, oh I just told you what I just did. Now, oh, shit. Uh, unfortunately, I think that we're going to have to lay low for a little while. Right? Well, you know, <clears throat> we discuss things with Martin. Oh, you think? Why don't you hop in the back? All right, now, Patricia, she already called shotgun. <laughs> now, I know a nice oh, little shit. place we can hang out. You know, it's a, a very relaxing little spot. A little getaway, if you will. A cabin in the woods. You know what I'm saying. Being the body soon. <laughs> you know what I'm saying. The Los Santos Transportation Authority announced. All right. <laughs> well. Unfortunately, I have to get ready for work. So, oh really? I don't remember much of anything that happens after I shot the plane down. Um.
We. Yeah, unfortunately, I have to uh, go to work. Got to make money. Sucks. We're going to raid somebody. Raid and pillage. Raid and pillage. Collect coins. Money. How do you raid and then go and watch, like, see the reaction and stuff like you did to me? Yeah, I'm on it. I'm watching myself right now. I know. Uh, so create a dashboard. Stream manager. Manager. It's on the. Raid channel. Yep. But la last night I raided somebody. But it didn't bring me to their channel. It ju I, I just sat and watched my own stream. So I didn't even get to see the reaction. Apparently, according to Siberian Tiger, they didn't even speak English, and they didn't even acknowledge I rated them, and they weren't even talking to chat. So it was kind of like, fuck, I messed up for everybody. Um, manage. It's on the right side in quick action. Yep, I see it. Have the oh, you have to open the own. You have to go to the stream, then copy the name. That speaks English. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I have, I have, I'm gonna open a new tab. And then oh, wait. Five. So I'm going to do someone that has more than one view, but less than 10. How about nine? Is nine good? Is nine a good number? That's the lowest one, other than one. With one view. I did that. He had one, and he didn't speak English. The other ones just they didn't even say if they don't speak English. That one's just chatting. It's a red flag. No, but to be honest, if I'm morning a burger, I don't go to McDonald's. I'm going to KFC and getting Shut a... Up. Oops, that didn't work. Ah. Okay, here we go. Now bring him in. We have a nice big bay for it. Bye bye.
my fucking god. Hey. What the fuck? Does this motherfucker not speak English? Fuck. Hey, Shit. you want some coffee? I'm trying to get some coffee. Do you know how to make some coffee? Take it. Take it. Please. I want coffee. Asshole. Holy shit. <laughs> <laughs>